Well, here we are in week six, uh, the last week in our course, and this week we're going to look at how the knowledge and skills that uh, we've been talking about and demonstrating over the past uh, five weeks, how they can be applied to creative projects. Yeah, this week our learners are going to create a two-minute piece of music, and then they're going to upload it to our online repository and share it with the online community. And so to help students who might feel a bit daunted by the task to do this, um, we're going to present a number of uh, musical ideas as recipes that they might use as basis for their work. Yeah, if you think back to what we uh, did in week one, where we filmed in my kitchen and we're cooking lunch, we talked about recipes there. And a recipe is essentially a list of ingredients and some instructions that involve techniques and processes to apply to those ingredients. Out of that, you can make food, but if you apply that concept to sound, you can create music. Yeah, and our approach to music making this week is going to be deliberately broad to cater to learners, you know, diverse range of backgrounds and experience in music. But um, to this end, you know, some of our uh, recipes will engage with a more kind of experimental kind of aesthetic and some of them more, uh, you know, contemporary popular music kind of context. That's right, because the technology we've been demonstrating, the ideas we've been talking about, aren't specific to any particular style of music. They can be applied to effectively to anything. Yeah, and um, the, the three recipes that we're going to demonstrate, um, you know, the first one's based around uh, ideas of Pierre Schaeffer and uh, Music Concrete, which, you know, was part of the Music Revolutionaries segments earlier uh, in the course. We'll also look at some of the ideas of UK uh, composer Trevor Wishart and this idea of sort of building, you know, narrative uh, or a story out of sound. And also we'll have a special guest appearance by DJ Tim Wish and he's going to demonstrate a recipe on how to make drum and bass. Yeah, and I'm really looking forward to hearing uh, the tracks that people upload uh, as a result of following one of these uh, recipes. I'm sure we're going to have some very imaginative and very different uh, projects coming out of this. Yeah, I'm really excited by that too and really look forward to you know, hearing the learners work. Yeah, so to start off I'm going to be introducing a recipe uh, for students who are interested in making something in the style of Pierre Schaeffer and music concrete, music made out of noises, in this case the noises recorded in my kitchen in week one. <laughs> 